Today's horoscope, Aquarius November 25, 2024. Discover your future with my daily horoscope for you about love, work, health, money and compatibility with other signs. The day's energies are upbeat, although sometimes impulsive in the first half of the day. Tension is building, especially if you're feeling restricted or without direction. Otherwise, it's a good time to access your inner wisdom and put your powers of observation to work. The moon spends all day in your intimacy sector, activating a desire to look for the layers of situations rather than take things at face value. The moon's trying to Uranus indicates a need to feel you're making progress. An emotional release or relief from a burden can figure strongly. You can be excited about making changes in your home or with family. As the day advances, others seek your guidance, advice, or support, and you're especially happy sharing your ideas and generous with your time. There can be wonderful inspiration through friends or networks right now. Still, with Mercury turning retrograde tomorrow, hard and fast decision-making is not advised. Hear the call of thunder. Mighty Mars, the god of sex and passion, has taken a turn within the heavens and has been highlighting your most important relationships for many weeks. From now until January 6, 2025, the red planet will energize your solar of partnerships, helping you to make long-term plans, take the leap, or work as a team with your significant other at your side. Singles can use this fuel to put themselves out there and attract someone with long-term potential. Don't be cautious or shy. If you want love, you have to show the universe that you're ready. Abrupt changes in the home might encourage you to focus on your financial standing. It is time to get organized when the moon in Virgo trines Uranus retrograde in Taurus. You may have dealt with financial inconsistencies in your personal life, which could have severely affected your lifestyle and family dynamics. The earthy energy will help you find stability today. Financial security and stability will come from being proactive with your plans. Go through your statements, budget, and expenses with a fine-tooth comb to prepare accordingly for the future. Your ability to manage your busy life has a lot to do with what you eat and drink, whether you exercise regularly, and how you take care of your bodily needs. Take a clear look at your eating habits and your exercise regimen. Can you prepare your own meals more often, starting from scratch, instead of just getting takeout or heating a prepared meal? Can you add some more vegetables instead of adding a second helping of meat? It is the little things that can stand in your way to a healthier lifestyle. Being aware is the first step. Be sure to recognize that not everything has to be about making the world a better place for all of humankind. Even you need to have the nurturing of a family where you can just relax and be yourself. You can expect to be more aware of this today, as there's a vibration in the air. Rather than just thinking about how much you love and appreciate these people, make a move to spend some quality time with them today. Even if you have to work, do something together this evening. As Pluto settles into his first weekend back in Aquarius there will be something familiar about the planet of change and transformation influence but also some big differences. Pluto had already been in Aquarius for seven months when he retrograded back out in early September and only gone for 11 weeks. This has been a chance for a do-over. However, both during the months already spent here this year or the few months last year, Pluto only ever poked his head in the door before turning retrograde making this more a chance to look to the future in any big changes but in a way that was simply observing. Here now for the next 20 years, it is time for the real thing. While the moon's departure from your relationship sector yesterday was always going to leave you feeling more emotionally engaged and aware, this first visit since Mars returned has already given you a better read on the planet of passion and the warrior planet of the cosmos influence. It was the moon's clash with Pluto, now in his first weekend back in Aquarius that has also helped to clarify your own and your relationship needs. Daily Planetary Overview Today's cosmic energy offers an intriguing mix of challenges and opportunities as the Moon in Virgo squares both Jupiter retrograde in Gemini and Mercury in Sagittarius. You may notice your thoughts spinning like a carousel or feel stuck in a loop of overthinking and self-doubt. But don't worry the universe is offering you tools to navigate this energy with grace and purpose. Let's dive in and see how you can make the most of today. 
Have you ever had a conversation that left you second-guessing everything you said? Or found yourself caught in an endless cycle of what-ifs when faced with a decision? That's the kind of energy the Moon-Jupiter-Mercury alignment can bring. You might feel unsure of what to say, how to act, or even what to think. But here's the good news, you are not your thoughts. When your mind feels like it's running in circles, remember that you have the power to pause and redirect. Try taking a deep breath and grounding yourself. Journaling, talking it out with a trusted friend, or even going for a brisk walk can help you gain clarity and ease that tension. What's your go-to method for clearing your mind when you're overthinking? With Mercury in bold Sagittarius squaring the analytical moon in Virgo, you might find yourself speaking more bluntly than usual. While honesty is a wonderful trait, today's energy can make your words come across as harsher than intended. Be mindful of how you communicate, especially with loved ones. Think about a time when you said something in the heat of the moment and later wished you'd worded it differently. What did you learn from that experience? Stress levels might feel higher than usual today, and your body will likely let you know if you're overdoing it. Whether it's a headache, fatigue, or just a sense of being off, pay attention to these signals. The cosmos are reminding you to create pockets of calm in your day. Consider this your permission slip to rest. It's not lazy or indulgent it's necessary for your well-being. Whether it's a 10-minute meditation, a favorite playlist, or a quiet moment with your favorite drink, small acts of self-care can make a big difference. What's one self-care ritual that always helps you recharge? If you've been navigating a tricky relationship or gearing up for an important conversation, today's energy gives you an edge. Your instincts are sharp, and you're likely to stay one step ahead in discussions. Use this time to clarify your boundaries, share your perspective, and make decisions that benefit you in the long run. When was the last time you had a breakthrough conversation that changed everything for the better? Reflecting on these moments can remind us of the power of communication and connection. On the financial front, things are looking positive. Transactions, investments, and even everyday money matters are running smoothly. This calm phase is a great time to research new opportunities, plan for the future, or even treat yourself to something meaningful. While it's tempting to ride the wave of energy and tackle everything on your list, remember the importance of balance. Overworking yourself now could lead to burnout later. Instead, focus on pacing yourself and celebrating each small victory along the way. Today is a day of duality overthinking and clarity, impulsivity and patience, stress and creativity. By staying mindful and intentional, you can navigate this cosmic energy with grace. Remember, the universe is on your side, cheering you on as you pursue your dreams and nurture your well-being. So, what's one thing you're focusing on today? Whether it's a personal goal, a relationship, or simply taking time to rest, let us know in the comments. Let's support each other on this journey of growth and discovery. Here's to a day of clarity, connection, and calm you've got this.